Hi, welcome to my channel. This is KB Worth Saving 101, and I am KB Kim Baker. If this is your first time visiting my channel, then welcome. I'm a lifetime thrifter turned reseller, and I currently resell on Poshmark, Macari, and Tradesy. And I'm always expanding my horizons. So if you're interested in lots of haul videos and reseller content, tips, tricks, do me a favor, hit that like and subscribe button down below because someday it may help me out. All right. So I'm going to dive right on in. Guys, I am like really behind. I think this is like my third video I'm filming today. I still would like to do another one, but um, I might run out of time. Anyway, let's go. Uh, let's see. So I have, I haven't even been able to hang this up. Uh, that's how behind I am. Um, just going to just, I don't even know. My favorites are going to be probably some of my last items, but there's favorites all throughout. I don't pick it up unless I really do like it. So uh, let's dive in. This happens to be um, Zalora Collections. Is that what it says? No, so uh, celebrates. Zalora celebrates. I have no idea. I've never heard of this brand, but I thought it was this absolutely adorable. And if you can see the Mandarin collar, these um, covered button details, this very oriental floor fit and flare. It is just so stinking cute. Um, yes, I just picked it up for, everybody say it, the print of it. Uh, <laughs> So yes, and what did I, did I say a size? A size medium. So there you go. Uh, this one is a Leslie Fay. It is this really super cute size eight um, cap sleeve, color blocked, black and tan um, sheath dress. So I love the colors on it. I think that should do well. All right, this happens to be a Calvin Klein extra large. I don't think it's made of anything spectacular, but I'll look. Uh, maybe I'll look. Okay, uh, I think it's been melted. Uh, I, I won't be able to look. Uh, polyester. No, there's nothing spectacular it doesn't look like. But I really thought it was super cute um, with a very interesting sleeve style like a little balloon sleeve three-fourths balloon sleeve um, with this boxy kind of fit so um, almost like a legging kind of look but yes all right so i just sold a pair of cabby pants of course i had a wonderful um picture of jennifer aniston wearing them but um yeah i made like fifty dollars on them so uh here's another pair of cabby pants size 10 they're Cabbie jeans, skinny, and they are in green. And since I had such a very quick and nice profitable flip on my last pair of cabbie pants, uh, we'll do it again. There we go. All right. And hopefully Jennifer's worn those too. <laughs> All right, now let's see. This is I have no brand, which isn't going to make a difference because it is um, going to be listed under vintage. Um, it has a union tag, so yay. Um, and I want to say that it's wool. Of course, it does not have a material tag, but it is this really super cute. You can see the, um, like, uh, it's not actually, it's like a cord kind of detailing. It's not like a velour or anything, but um that detail is throughout with the pockets, down the front with the buttons, and um, even these little side slits with, with buttons. Isn't that cute? Um, I think it's adorable. So, yes, again, I know, I picked it up. It's out of season. Wait till you see what else I found out of season. Um, okay, so let's see. This is a Calvin Klein size large, and I think it's a men's. Um, it's a nice dress shirt. Um, I love the colors and the stripes and the button down. Um, yeah, nothing spectacular, but I don't know. In all actuality, I'd probably go through, roll up the sleeves, tie it in a knot, and wear a pair of jean shorts with it. So, um, you know, with the tank or whatever, um, I think it's adorable. So, yeah, I might put unisex 
what do they have it listed underneath their new Poshmark, um, I forgot, category. But yeah, it could be either or, I think, personally. All right. Now, if you watched, <laughs> uh, I did an unboxing. I'm trying to get into, I'm expanding my um, ideas um, as far as what my business is. Um, and this happens to be a shirt. Yes. And do I have any info on it? It says Elite. It is a baseball jersey long sleeve, and it says the unknowns in this really bright, vibrant orange. Um, I don't even think I have, oh wait, here, I do have a tag. It is a size small, um, but I have no brand or anything. Um, oh, except for, it says Elite. Sorry, I guess I do have a brand. Um, I will have to Google, but for a dollar, I definitely thought since I spent $10 per shirt in one of my um, in my unboxing video, uh, for a buck, I'll give that a shot. Okay, this is another one. Again, I know nothing. It's and one basketball, and it's a size large, and it just says and one. And, and one. So, um, yes, I will do some Googling, but hey, I'm giving it a shot. All right. Now onto the stuff that I normally pick up. <laughs> this is so stinking cute. It is a Talbot's, um, and hold on. I don't see if there's any um, material tag of what, if any. Let's see, is it made of anything spectacular? Cotton, spandex, nope. Cut, well, cotton. I don't mind putting cotton blend. Spandex means it has stretch. So, um, but it is this absolutely adorable, and I got it for the print of it. Um, sleeveless scoop uh, sheath dress in this really vibrant colored print. Um, let's see, it is more like, uh, there it's looking very light. It's a little bit more vibrant in person. So adorable. Did I say it's Talbot's size eight? There you go. All right. Next. I like to pick up new tags just so that, um, yes, I have new tags. And um, that is a searchable, you know, category. So this is, I don't know, how do I say that one? Honey. Whatever. Anyway, you know I like to slaughter them. Um, and so it's new tags. It is a size large, and I don't believe it's made of anything spectacular, but I would look, because you never know, rayon, polyester, spandex. Um, it is nice and soft. It has like kind of like a, um, a legging look to it, and it has this like, um, oh shoot, I'm blanking on the name, pussy bow? I think it's called a pussy bow in the front, so, um, and it's this layered um, dress. Uh, looks like it's a carnigan, um, but yes, it's all together. So I'll give that a shot for a buck. Okay. Give me this one. Rockin'. It's Style and Company. New with tags, extra, extra large in this like sweatshirt material, zip up, zip pocket. Um, it's not a hoodie, but yeah, sweatshirt zip up sweatshirt um and it does have a very interesting collar with the snaps almost like i don't know an 80s and when i open it up there's more snaps so it has like that 80s collar or i don't know so there you go split collar yes new with tags no problem all right one of my favorite brands to pick up it is a Chico's. This one is a Zenergy. It is a size three. And are we made of anything spectacular? I don't see. And da da da. Cat and spandex. Yes, there we go. That's it. And a little bit of polyester. Um, it is a super cute, very almost boho, nautical boho. Is that such a thing? Um, because it has this um like rope um rope lace detailing um and it's i mean it's very boho um but it for some reason it kind of gives me a nautical vibe um and it it's a, a zip jacket 
Um, when listing Chico's, I do go through and in the title, I will put size three. Um, and then in my listing, um, as far as the actual size, I put it under the size it would correlate to. So that's how I like to list mine. And Chico's does very well for me. All right, another new with tags. I think this is stinking adorable. This is a Jessica Howard. It is a size 14. Um, I do sell her, so I don't have a problem picking it up, especially new with tags. Um, yeah, it's not like I have to get to this anytime soon, but it has this little faux fur trimmed, and it's just adorable. Look at that. So, yeah, um, nice size. Okay. Onward. This one is a size 18 American Eagle Outfitters, and um, it's just like a little tunic. Oh, no, it's a dress. It's like a little dress. I would definitely wear like a little bralette with it because it has some very deep um, armholes, and um, but it's really soft, cute, and good size. We'll see how it does. All right, this one happens to be um, a Ralph Lauren, a Lauren, Ralph Lauren, sorry, and it is a size six, um, and it is this two-toned lace um, stretch skirt, and um, yes, it's past the knee. Um, you know, Ralph has been a hit or miss for me, so we'll see how she does. Um, it's more of like a, a vintage style, so um, and it's in these blues, and that looks really funky. It's not like that. It's a paler blue this time. So um, anyway, all right. I this one was just too cute, and for a buck, I'm sorry. Um, Windsor, and yes, I have sold plenty of that. Um, it's just this really super cute. It has this like really deep V, um, and it's a fit and flare. But wait, there's more, and a beautiful floral that has shorts there you go don't have to worry about your tushy hanging out on that one um so, oh, and what size did i say did i say i didn't say oh lord i'm sorry i'm going to just ignore there we go uh size is if i can find a size uh oh it has a paper tag that's interesting um, medium. It's a size medium made in the USA. Very interesting. I'll have to do a little bit more research, but I think it's absolutely adorable. So there you go. Okay. Now this one, um, I do okay with Liz Claiborne. Um, and this one happens to be a vintage, um, size 12 and it has the Da, 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 the union tag so I'm stoked about that um, it's just an acetate ran it's like this velour um, embossed velour I don't know if you can see the embossing um, in this like a squiggle um, and it is a maxi to the floor um, let's see does it have a back slit oh it does have um, a back slit Sorry, guys, my lights are not letting you see the prettiness of it. Um, but yeah, so um, vintage Liz, it is missing the belt, but that's okay. All right, onward, onward. Here we go. These are new with tags. This is a Mark Andrew Extra Small, um, and they are faux suede, I don't know, jeggings, leggings. Uh, high-waisted skinny um, in black so yes new with tags I'll take that all right um, this one I did look up on uh, thread up to see and they were valued pretty high so it's Carolina Bella uh, I'll show you the tag hmm um, and uh, it is in all the different, so it's a US 10, Canada, UK. So um, because of the sizing, um, of course, I'm going to look it up. They are this gray. Again, I apologize. They got this like, I don't know, box check. Um, and uh, they are a skinny, but they're a nice little dress pant with front pockets. And let's see, are you, how high are you? 
probably a mid-rise. I would say mid-rise, but um, the pants were this our original cross-off price were quite high. So um, yeah, I said, guess what? I'll give it a shot for a buck. All right, this one I might be trying on. Um, this is um, EP Golf, um, EP, EP Pro, size eight, um, and it's a cotton blend, cotton spandex blend, um, little skirt, and it's in this uh, reptile print in tan and cream. Has a little back pocket, side zip entry, and do I have any other pockets? Yes, a front pocket. Just one front pocket, one back pocket, but they're really super cute. And yes, I don't know, it's athletic. So there we go. All right, this, I have another piece. I haven't got to list it yet. I know, I'm so behind. All right, this is Young, Broke, and Fabulous. Oh no, Young, Fabulous, and Broke, whatever. Um, said it wrong. I do need to, as I'm watching TV, just repair this little right there. Um, it's got all the sequins though, and it is this adorable, I don't know if you'd say dip dyed, um, ombre, striped, um, sequined, uh, really super cute, sleeveless scoop neck um, shift dress. So there we go. I will give that a shot. I like the colors to it. Okay. Now, can't go wrong with my belt. This one happens to be a Torrid. No, does it say if it's an, what it's made out of? Um, it's just a polyurethane wax rope. So, but it is this um, black braided weaved um, belt, and it says size zero zero zero. I don't know, um, but um, I do have a measuring chart. If you don't follow me, ooh, did I make a boo boo? I might have made a boo boo. I gotta stretch this out or something. I'll take some heat to it and figure it out. Um, it, looks, it looks a little funky down here, um, but I don't know. I, normally these hang anyway, so I wouldn't be, you know, it's no big deal. Um, maybe it's even made, it's got the slit. Maybe it could be knotted. I don't know. Anyway, um, I go through and on my Instagram, I have put a um, how to size your belt chart. Um, and so if you don't follow me there, it is some good info. It has helped me sell quite a few belts. All right, now, ready? This is the best part of the haul, guys, and guess what? They're all kind of out of season. <laughs> so, and they were all a dollar. Uh, let's see, oh, I didn't see that on there. Hopefully it comes off, and if not, oh no, it's gonna come off. All right, so who are you? Who are you? Oh, these are, um, Carl's by Carlos Santana. They are a leather upper size seven and a half, and they look very equestrian like. Um, so that definitely will be in like my title because um, yes, during watching the fashion shows uh, for fall, equestrian. There was a lot of those boots. Um, so there you go. Ah another pair I mean leather boots guys come on like you're not gonna make at least like 20 to 29 if not way higher on these things I love it all right who are you I don't know who you are who are you oh I think these are the these are um, a zero a zero um, I don't know that truffle or whatever it is uh, but yeah anyway I believe that they are not an actual leather, um, that they are, man, here it is. Um, it just says made in China and has some numbers. So of course I'll be doing some Googling, but, and I've never found Zara. These are like brand new. And um, since the style is pretty much on target, I didn't really care. I figured I'd just go through for a dollar and pick them up and give them a shot. Okay. Now, okay, I have one more pair of tall boots. <laughs> Who are you? You are, I can't read you. Who are you? There's nothing in that one. 
All right. Um, so I have some tags down here on the bottom. They were originally $99. And um, it says jcpenny.com. It's a truced size seven black. Um, it's funny because these treads, look at those. Again, never worn. But the inside, I couldn't read the leather on that one. And you can't read it there either. So, um, but with the sticker, I can go through and look it up. Um, they're just like this little heeled, um, rounded toe, um, tall calf, well, what, above the knee. Yeah, about knee length um, boot. So, yeah. Okay. Now, these are comfort shoes. They're aerosols. And what size are we? We are a nine medium. They're the jigsaw puzzle. Um, I like it when they have their names in it. Um, and they are leather, I believe. Um, and they're US size eight. Um, but they're just a comfort slide on shoe, um, like rubber soles in great condition. So um, comfort shoes do sell well for me. I mean, I don't think they're that, all that pretty, but people want comfort sometimes for their feet, not necessarily the beauty of it all. All right. Keep moving, keep moving. Okay, so I've got three, four, um, four more pairs here. Um, I've got a pair of uh, like penny loafers. Uh, they are patent leather um, pen, penny loafers and they are by Ann Klein. Oh, and they are a leather. It says leather. Um, let's see if the other one gives me a name or um, what size. It says, it does say something. Um, AK7 L A D O R E. So I will Google those. Um, and they look like a size nine and a half. So just stay on the bottom. They're the AK and Klein Flex. Again, they're in decent shape. Um, loafers, I have seen a lot of people that are, yeah, that those are supposed to be in. Yeah, it looks like nine and a half. Um, so, and they're brown. Um, these have a little dust on them. So I'm going to list these and you're going to, crack, you might want to crack up. But the first item that ever went through and like I got a sale on, which I had to cancel, um, on Tracy was Ann Klein dress. Ann Klein, so I have three pairs of Ann Klein boots. Oh, I have the loafers and I have two pairs of boots. Um, these I might try on. They're super cute. They're the Ann Klein 2 or Ann 2 Klein. Um, nine medium and what else do we have as info leather upper balance man-made size nine um, so they are super cute um, they're like a little calf height with this um, ankle wrap um, really super soft leather uh, they're more of like a mm, square toe um, chunkier heel and they are again in really good shape so um, they may be listed or they may be on my feet. <laughs> Next, I have another pair of Ann Klein and they are a nine medium. So, um, and this, what do they say here? Leather upper, yes, nine medium, no name of the style or anything in them. Um, but they're like this little kind of kitten heel, pointy toed, calf boot so um or ankle booty i probably put this one more as ankle sorry um and uh yeah super super soft leather excellent condition so all of those you will find will be listed on tradesy along with poshmark and magari uh, okay next and my last and final item but guys do you see what i mean for a dollar yes boots are they gonna sell right now no do I have room to store it? Yeah, um, but I'm gonna get a higher dial value. Um, and when they're available, I get them. So these are really super, super cute. These are Bobby Blue. I've never heard of this brand, but look at how Southwest adorable is this little, look at this. I just am, oh, 
zipper entry. They are leather. Look at the, like, the stitching detail thing on the heel. Um, they're so stinking cute. Uh, let's see, what else does it say? Um, it says factory leather upper 10 medium, which is just a 10. M just is a normal um, sizing, but uh, <clears throat> I think they're adorable. I think there was some minor wear on one of them, but um, yes, I think I will list these high because they're so stinking cute. And um, yeah, there you go. That's it. That's all I got for this week, guys. I hope you enjoyed my haul. Um, I hope you come back and see me again. <laughs> but until next time, 